John Wesley Hardin was one of the meanest, most dangerous outlaws in the Old West, but even he knew when to tip his hat to greatness. Wild Bill Hickok, while Marshal of Abilene, Kansas in May of 1871, would meet Hardin, unaware that he was one of the most wanted men in the Western territories, and demand that he hand over his guns within the city limits. Hardin slowly pulled his guns from his vest, handing them to Hickok, butts forward, but quickly rolled them in his hands, putting Wild Bill Hickok at the end of two loaded barrels. Before either took action, Hardin would drop them both and hand them over to Hickok, later claiming that this would seed a mutual respect between the two of them, even going so far to say that when his cousin, Manon Clements, was arrested for murder, Hickok would help him escape at Hardin's request. 